Yeah, what you think gonna you happen think? with this um with this Trump indictment? They talking about they might, you know, they always look. I try not to get excited. Nothing. Anytime they start talking about Trump gonna get some discipline, but it seemed close this time, don't it? it no. Does close. it? Does it? It was supposed but to come down it. today. Has it happened? It was supposed to come down in 2015. That's what I'm saying. So I'm just uh, <laughs> let, can we, let's Shoot. let's just live our lives and not be hopeful because I feel like we're in America, where you know. The last time I, I kept hope alive was when Jesse ran for president. That was the last Listen, time he told us. I can tell you right now, if they lock Trump up, them white folks going to go get his ass. That's, that, you remember First of all, they're going to have to worry. Here's what they're going to have to worry about. The, the the guards taking him to jail. Like, I don't even think he's going to make it to jail before somebody breaks him out. Like, everybody, in my opinion, is suspect all the oh, way yeah, into Oh yeah, this is like a Marvel movie. Somebody, somebody gonna lean and whisper in Trump ear, "Hail Hydra," <laughs> and then, you and then give him a give him a key card <laughs> so he can break himself out. I, it's gonna be like and lean on me. All them white folks gonna go to the jail like when the black folks showed up to say, "Free Mr. Clark." You thought then, you thought so let, let you thought January six was a riot. Lock Trump up. See if the white folks don't run up in there. Before we get into the to, to the news of the day, Roy Wood Jr. is here. Um, everybody from Chelsea Handler to Wanda. My bad. That's who, my homeboy family calling who? me saying that they're going to give me the 1200 oh, Hang on. Oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah, y'all give me money. All right, cool. Yeah, they, they listening to Karen Hunter right now. All okay, right. Cool. I told them not to ask you for the money. You know. <laughs> 866-801-8255, Roy Wood Jr. So they've had Chelsea Handler, Mary, Mar- uh, what's the name? Which one? Wayans. One of them Wayans, though. Marlon, the, Marlon, the, came Marlon, in. Yo, Marlon. Marlon came in and showed love, man. Marlon yes, had... yeah, that's what I was going to say. I felt like you were co-hosting when he was there, which felt Look, good. You know, Marlon, one of my old comedy OGs, when I was doing mornings in Birmingham, Marley used to come in every year to do the comedy club. He come do my morning show. Why are you still here? Huh? Why are you still in Alabama? You need to get your ass up out of here, man. You need to go somewhere, man. You're good. So it was like one of them full circle moments to be sitting on a daily show set with the same brother who told me, you know, back in the day that your talents are bigger than, you know, we talked about that before. When you, when you doing what you love in a place that's not ideal for it, it take a lot to make that leap. It take a lot to make that jump. So Marlon was one of those people that I always looked up to in the world of Hollywood. And, uh, you know, he was dope. Marlon had great energy. You know, he had some good ass energy was Leslie Jones. Like I would say Marlon and Leslie neck and neck in terms of just who just had the most fun during okay. the week and just I, kicking it. Mm, for, for the platform, I thought Chelsea Handler murdered it during her week yeah yeah yeah. but i'm just talking just negroes vibing in the studio okay right? okay like, that part chelsea i don't, we don't know i don't see i don't know what that is jokes. yeah yeah but chelsea got the the most pedigree out of everybody chelsea and wanda sykes dl hughley kind of caught a bad one because the tyree nichols video came out that week so he didn't really get to be funny not There's for the first day and a half yeah. Yeah, especially yeah. not Monday, not when you got police killing videos coming out. So he had to be DL had to be a lot more serious in the studio. And he handled it, and you know that's his pedigree. But in terms of just actual just energy and kicking it in the building, I had a good ass time with Marlon, yo. Well, no, I could tell. I could tell. I was smiling, yeah. and then I was saying at the same time, when because you're gonna get your your seat in the in the seat. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's supposed to be a couple of weeks. It's supposed to be in April. They ain't figured out which day yet in okay. which week yet in April. But I'm around the corner. Because you know, I'll be honest, man. Like with the guest hosting stuff, like you you know, not everybody that's guest hosting wants to host the show in the fall. You know, some folks just coming in and just doing a thing. And then you got folks that are coming in and actually like trying and like, oh, OK. Oh, this month. Hassan Masa- Minaj. Yeah. Hass Minaj yes. want, wants Hassan. it. Yes. Um, Chelsea wants it. I would say that if they offered it to Leslie, Leslie would consider. And in fact, if Leslie stayed, if Leslie was the host, I would consider staying for a little while. Mm-hmm. Just you know, to work, yes. Just to with work her. with Leslie. Okay. Like, well, I've, when you talk to her, I find out why she blocked me on Twitter. 
I, I know I, I ain't say Uh-oh. nothing to her. Oh, just find man. out. Just find out for me. I just because oh, she be man. saying stuff that's funny, and then I can't look at it because I'm blocked for some oh, reason. I think she said to let I don't you know. I don't, it could have been anything, Roy, and nothing at the same time. I feel like I got swept up in one of them days <laughs> when she got mass when she hit the block button on everybody. Because I block people by accident, and you don't know once they're blocked because they can't. I don't block. T- I don't you. block nobody. I don't block nobody. I just get it off your chest and we'll keep it moving. Cause then I'm not gonna let you be running around bragging about you block me. There's a couple celebs that have me blocked and I'm not even mad about it. Cause it's, I probably did say something crazy. I did more than radio for a long time. So I talked a lot of shit like that. <laughs> it's, it's quite Wait, wait possible. people listen to us on the radio. I, I, oh. I assume that it's just me and you talking and you know, whatever goes on in this box here stays in this box here but that's see a, that's the thing but you gotta remember though we twitter ogs when we did twitter we just figured we was only talking to the person who was replying we didn't know it exactly. was a whole ass people yeah. just eavesdropping on your comment twitter like yelling in a food court everybody can hear you oh my god yeah they be rubbernecking and um ear hustling yeah uh, eyeball hustling i guess it would be on twitter because there's no yeah there. but i mean you know i'm gonna put it like this man if comedy central talking about wanting me to host i'm talking about trying to take the chair you gonna offer that to me because if it's one thing comedy Central know how to do is give black men a lot of money let them quit the job and then they go back to africa so I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to be number three. Uh, come on, wait, who? Oh, mm-hmm. yes, Dave. And then yeah. Trevor. Well, Trevor's from mm-hmm. Africa. Does that count? Yeah. First to be from met, Africa. Literally, the day after his last day, Trevor was in South Africa with, with cornrows. That's not even a joke. That's hilarious. That's All how right, where, would you, <laughs> where would you go in Africa? I don't matter. I ain't never been to Africa. So just pick a You city. have never been to Africa? I could never afford it. And by the time I had the money for it, I was in New York. Okay. With a child. All right. There you go. Here you go. Here's, here's what you got. Listen, I need my twelve hundred dollars because I need to go to Africa to the motherland. That's how you get your money back from them people. Tell them I'm you are s- you plan a trip to Africa. The the ticket costs twelve hundred dollars, and you know. Okay, and that's what he would have wanted. Your your loved one would have wanted me to go to Africa. I mean, honestly, with all this deep fake and this AI stuff, I probably could fake a voicemail from him. I just need some okay. video of him talking. You know, they got that software now. They can make the, the, the talking sound like you. No, it's true. No, for, it's scary, it actually. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm concerned scary. about it. We did a chat GPT thing yesterday where um, Cena was on, Cena Gaznavi, and he, he said, uh, what did he say? Tell me uh, something in the voice of Karen Hunter. Write me something in the voice of Karen Hunter. And it didn't get it right, you know, because mm-hmm. I don't use certain vernacular. But it was it was scary, though. Cause I'm like, you trying to get it right. Eventually you will. So let me, sw- I'm about to switch up. I'm about to hey. throw some different words in here. Hey, shout out to the homie, uh, too bad Mike on Twitter. He just tweeted us. He said, make a fake invoice. <laughs> there you <laughs> go. A place he used to work good, and make it seem good, like it's a debtor, a creditor. A you know one. what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's a good one. 